Yeah, the box office numbers movie, yeah. are in, and as expected, yeah. Hunger Games Mockingjay Part 1 held on to the number one spot. The film took in another $57 million, bringing its North American total to over $225 million, and its worldwide total to over $480 million. In second spot was the new animated film, The Penguins of Madagascar, making $25.8 million on its opening weekend and $36 million total. In third place is Big Hero 6, making $18.7 million. In fourth, it's Interstellar, making $15.8 million and rounding out the top five is a new film Horrible Bosses 2 making 15.7 million this weekend and 23 million in total. Schnepp what stands out to you about this weekend's box office results? Uh, what stands out is Horrible Bosses didn't make that much money. I mean, isn't it its first opening weekend? It's, it's opening, opening weekend. weekend. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, well, I mean, yeah, I mean, all the everything is a little down a little bit. I mean, Hunger Games obviously is still commanding most of the cash that's coming in. So everyone's seeing, everyone who didn't see it the first weekend is now seeing it. So they're catching up. So, I mean, that's what kind of stands out is everything else is sort of like in the middle. Like they're all really close to each other, like 15, 15, right. 15. I, I think number one, what stands out to me the most is that Big Hero 6 in its third week took a 6.7% drop. Wow. A, only a 6.7% drop from week two to week three. That's crazy good number. On top of that, Interstellar went up 3%. Right. Interstellar, I mean, still only coming in at 15 million, but it actually made more money in its third week than it did in its second week. I thought that was interesting. And don't, I, I think um, Horrible Bosses came in right around where I expected it to. I mean, remember it opened early. And so its total opening week number was, was actually 23 million, right. which is actually a pretty good number for, for an R-rated comedy like that. I don't think they were expecting much more, especially going against the juggernaut that was Mockingjay. Mm. Um, and uh, for the first time in nine weeks, Gone Girl drops out of the right. top five, down to the number eight spot. What a run that film has been having. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, really interesting. What stands out to you, Jamie? About well, the what's results? interesting, a couple things. Well, one with Horrible Bosses, too, that doesn't really surprise me. I mean, I liked the first Horrible Bosses a lot, but was anyone really, like, you really wanted a sequel? Did, did I, you, I did. You were I like, love give me a sequel. One. Okay, I, mean, I, I, I like the first one a lot. So it doesn't surprise me the sequel didn't do as well as the first one. Um, the other thing that uh, I thought was not surprising, but I wanted to talk about Penguins. Um, I really liked it. I don't know if you guys got a chance to see it. it it's, it's really well done. But what I thought was interesting with the marketing is they really sold it on sort of a Madagascar spinoff and a Madagascar right. sequel, which makes a lot of sense since Madagascar was a huge franchise. But when I saw the movie, this is really a superhero film. Like, the penguins are superheroes, and they, and they join up with another sort of superhero animal team that, of course, Benedict Cumberbatch is the voice <laughs> of, because he's in everything. Um, and I'm really surprised with the success of Beer, Big Hero 6 and the success of superhero films in general, that Fox didn't really play that up with the marketing hmm. and sell that as more of a fun, you know, superhero penguins as opposed to we're just a spinoff from Madagascar, which is what I saw in all the advertising. Um, that being said, it's really good. So it, it did well. I mean, nothing is going to compete with the juggernaut that is yeah. Mockingjay. So now, what's the feeling on how Mockingjay is doing as far as, I mean, has it hit its expectations? Is it a little below expectations? It's, well, it's hard to say. I mean, right now, worldwide, in just two weeks, the film's made $480 million worldwide. Yeah. Like, let that sink in. $480 million worldwide in two, two weeks. weeks. So uh, they've got to be happy. I yeah. mean, could it have been better? Sure. Yeah, other... I, I know the feeling in opening weekend was it was a little lower than expectations. The first Twilight, the first of the last two Twilights, the first of the last two Harry Potters did a little bit better in their opening weekend. Well, and the, previous Hunger, and the previous Hunger Games, Games did, did a little have a better, better opening right. weekend. But right. I, I think... People I, also know this is not the final movie. It's the beginning yeah. of the final movie. Exactly. I think we need to just wait a few more weeks, sit back, and then yeah. look at what the total numbers of it are. But right now, it's, it's running pretty good. Yeah. Hey, everyone. If you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news, as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.